One plus nine RT, it's now official. Hello guys, hope you all are doing great. We are back. The all new one plus nine RT is now official. So today tech chat is going to be about one plus nine RT. So what do you guys know about one plus nine RT? Let's start the discussion with the camera. So the biggest change will be in the cameras as one plus will be utilizing the incredible Sony IMX 766 as its primary camera sensor. In both low light and natural light, this camera is capable of capturing some stunning images and those images are equipped with an OIS as well as EIS. However, the two megapixel macro, the 16 megapixel IMX481 and the 16 megapixel front facing IMX471 all take precedence. As a result, these specifications aren't exactly mind blowing. Meanwhile, there's no question that the primary sensor on OnePlus 6T is top notch, but the other sensors are the same old ones that OnePlus keeps promoting. Even Samsung's A series cameras use telephoto lenses so OnePlus will definitely have to step up their performance. When we come to image processing and color accuracy, both are handled by several pieces of software. The best thing is that the C9RT comes pre-installed with a Warp Charge 65T power brick. As we all know, all of the big players, including Xiaomi, Samsung, and of course the original Apple, are delivering high-end smartphones without a power brick. However, OnePlus has retained it, which is highly appreciable in my point of view. So moving into the CPU, the Snapdragon 888 5G CPU within the the 9RT is fabricated using a 5 nanometers technology. And now that the 898 is on the way, I personally expect OnePlus to get rid of its old stock as quickly as possible. So we can expect a flagship class CPU with 8 cores and 12 gigabytes of RAM, as well as maximum internal storage of 256 gigabytes. Because 888 generates a great deal of heat, they decided to utilize a huge heat chamber for this experiment. As a result, the OnePlus 9RT may become hot quickly. It has Colorways 11 pre-installed and Colorways 12 beta available for anyone who are interested in trying it out. When discussing about the battery. Dual cell 4500 mAh batteries in the 9RT let it to run for 29 minutes on a single charge, and you are given the opportunity to choose from a variety of attractive color schemes. As you can see, this one comes in a hacker black and nano silver color scheme, and it's a limited edition, which means a high priced version. So, moving on to the newly added features a three antenna Wi Fi system for greater range, a touch sampling rate of 600 Hz, and a virtual RAM option of 7GB set the new 9 series apart from the others. Finally, display wise, we can expect a 6.62-inch E4 screen with 1080p resolution and a fast refresh rate. A smoother user experience as well as improved display quality can be received as a result of this. Apart from that, it seems like OnePlus is sticking with the same hole punch flat design as the OnePlus 9. So before winding up, I would like to say 3,299 yuan for 8 128GB. The 9RT offers excellent specs and an even better pricing. And that's only a personal opinion. So that's all for today. See you guys in the next video. So let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. If you guys are new here, be sure to subscribe. The tech chat is over and I am out.